Assalamualaikum. Assalamualaikum. Hello, Mr. Anwar, Mr. Arifuddin. Thank you for making the time to see me as the strategic manager of our company, our gaming company. I think uh, we are very happy. Yeah, both of you from the technical unit, from the development unit. That's everything good, is no? okay. Yeah, everything is okay. Uh, and we are we are good. I think there's there's no problem there in terms of the new games coming out, the mobile games coming out. It's no problem there. But I'm just calling both of you here to think about what to do for the next half of the year. Because we need to plan. A good organization needs to plan. And we don't want to play catch up, you know, to the other big companies, you know, to Square Enix and uh, you know, there's big companies that are coming up. Yeah, EA, EA, definitely. We don't want we to don't catch want to up. Them. We don't want to lose ground to them because they are always leading. They have more budget than us. They have more, you know, resources than us. But we've got you. I've got both of you, the leading thinkers, yeah, in the business. So you guys, what what ideas you can be, you can give for the future? Because I like to suggest, why not we move more into VR, into virtual reality? games with 360s spherical you know videos to actually engage people in there but there is also a problem gentlemen the problem is not many people have you know access yeah, to vr technology you, not many people can afford them. that's the, the problem for our teenagers you know uh, that's our main target our target will be for teenagers they don't have much money so what do you think is it a good idea going into vr i think personally vr is like the next best thing okay right now uh, there's we are not looking more to the console games yeah. we are looking forward to the uh, the reality i mean try yeah. to put try immersive to, bring, to yeah, immersive. be in the situation yeah. we are bringing the reality to them rather than them going to the reality we are bringing reality to them and so in uh, have the you words, guys done any, any plan mm. have you guys done any market survey and all because you just said just now mr arifuddin that uh, you know, a lot of our customers are still very young. They don't have access well, to the technology. Well, in my opinion, yeah. VR is the future. It is, it is. But in terms of the product hardware and accessibility, I yeah. think the future is not there yet. Because there yet. VR, uh, generally, no, right. they're still very expensive to produce. Yeah. Much more to, uh, of course. to sell to them. Of course. It's like triple, a quadruple, four yes. times more than the normal game in terms of development. So, do you think we should move into that segment or we mm -hmm. hold on first? Maybe hold on first. Maybe maybe one or two special projects for that. Two, one or two special one projects. Two okay, projects. just to try out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you good with that? Deep into the quarter. Okay. Okay. What yeah. kind of genre then? You think? Um, yeah, before that, to add more to his point, just yes, now, uh, you just said just now it's a bit expensive, isn't yeah. it? So to add more to that, right. we I highly think that we should hold on to that project first yeah. to avoid any. Uh, loss of the company I mean if we we, we can produce the, yeah. the games but okay. our biggest concern is that nobody will buy it nobody <laughs> could buy it yeah uh -huh, maybe just a few but we couldn't uh, bring any profit to the company so we try one not two mm -hmm. one special we can just try one, just one, 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 one do you think yeah. you guys are the developer no? the uh, kids nowadays are into shooting games and shooting uh, uh, zombie no maybe not horror, horror? I think shooting and horror, can we, we can combine that. Can together. combine them both. Yeah. Because VR genre. is very immersive, yeah. I think horror will be more amplified. Yeah, right. The horror genre okay. by you. But just, just be careful, also in terms of the rating, please. We don't want yeah. to go yeah. to yeah. 18. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Bring it down more. to 12. Yeah. yeah. So, so something cute, maybe. Uh, I don't know. You, you guys are the developer. You guys are but the thing that. I think that whatever genre it is, the use of VR. Uh, because it's, it's immersive, you can see everything that go, is going on in the yeah. in the game. It's like you are there uh, itself. All right. uh, so I think we can just stick with any genre. Okay. Uh, for now, we're sticking with the zombie killing okay, stuff. You, uh -huh. you guys go through that first. How about okay? Another idea. Uh, I've been talking to the other senior partners. We are thinking about AR, AR augmented okay. reality. Yeah. You know things like you have that Minecraft. game. Uh, yeah, Minecraft, uh, Pokemon, Pokemon Go. Pokemon. Remember? Yeah, that's what they do. People go running out there, you know, trying to catch those, uh, you know, those, those annoying characters. cute things. Yeah, exactly. You guys are going into that? How about planning to go into that? Yeah. So one is very mobile. Oriented. There you go. Yeah. It's mobile it's oriented. Very easy to use. You don't have to buy the headgear. You don't have to buy the goggles. You don't need. 
you know expensive gym that's it anyone with mobile phones can anyone can gain access there to you it. go and it's good I think in terms of getting our children to go out and exercise that's, right. that's, that's the main idea good. to yeah. look at them out of the house okay uh, on top of my head a local content for Malaysians for example for children what, what would be good you know let's say she's you know catch 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 what catch the Malaysian fun chill mouth fairy tales I don't know so. fairy tales fairy tales Malaysian fairy tales Characters from Malaysian fairy tales that you can catch using your mobile phone. Like, maybe so that, that something like <laughs> Badang, maybe. Yes, Badang. Badang yes, Badang. 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 Or, right. Can you guys think about that? Batu belah batu tangku. Yes, and I <laughs> don't think that can be translated into <laughs> English or so. Yeah. But yeah, but yeah. You, you, you guys see where I'm going with that? We can use uh, just like you said. You cannot change it to English. You can yeah. just stick with the the, the the mother tongue language. Yeah, uh, but the ideas are already there. So maybe catching, I don't know, I don't know. It's, all, it's, it's up to you guys. Just coming up with the ideas. And it's always good to have the strategic plans. So one special project for VR, one for AR. But we are going more towards so AR, AR, I think, because it's, yes. uh, it's more realistic. And, realistic. Uh, yeah, more realistic yeah, approach. Young people have uh, mobile phones. They can yeah, use it all It's very accessible. Everyone can play the game. Ah, lovely. So yeah, I'll see you guys uh, in the next meeting then. All right. Uh, have uh, some concrete plans, write it out. Uh, you know, uh, so uh, get your teams together. We'll we'll uh, we'll show you the prototype first done. as soon as possible. Well done. Take your time, but half a year, which means that we are ready to launch within six months. Are we good there? Very good. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Jack. I'll see you then. All right. Thank, Thank you. you.